Hello everyone, my name is Anitsu, and I'm back with a, a, another Bushy Road video. So today, Bushy Road uh, decided to uh, fully announce what their plans for the Shop League are, because earlier in the year they had announced that they were doing it, and now we have those details. Obviously, the Bushy Shop League is going to be a new thing that they're rolling out, and they are basically saying that they're going to be supporting the games that they're currently supporting, and it's going to run for about two seasons from September to December. So mathematically, that's about a season is two months. And we have the chance to win some nice PR cards. So going into what the tournament structure basically is, uh, basically it's going to be a shop-level tournament, and it's going to be held weekly or up to the shop if they want to hold it weekly. But basically, the circuit will run for two seasons. So season one is September to October, and then season two is November to December. And then you'll get points based on your performance each event. So participation will get you one point, third place will get you two points, second place will get you three, and first will get you five. And then all of the points are shop locked, so that way you could rack up a new set of points at a different shop if you have that ability. And then the prizes will be distributed at the end of each season. So all participants with five points and up get just one base PR card. And then third place will get a special foil PR card plus, plus the base PR card. Second place will get two copies of the foil PR card plus the base PR card. And then first place will get three copies of the special PR card plus the base. So that's kind of the general breakdown. And the important thing is the prizes. So these are the prizes. I hope this is the prizes for season one. I can probably understand if they do this for season two as well. Uh, it would be a little bit unfortunate, but completely understandable. But these are the current prizes. I have absolutely nothing to say about these three, considering I don't play them or I don't care about them. And obviously, I care about the Buddy Fight card. So, going into the Buddy Fight card, they are reprinting Rearch Empress as the Shop League promo. So... Obviously, this is a pretty good card. It was pretty scarce and hard to find the first time around, considering it was a promo in a expensive trial deck. So it's nice to see it getting a reprint here. And it's a pretty good card in which, if your opponent were to search their deck, you basically discard this card, and they get to search the top four of their deck instead. Obviously, with the way the game is shaping up due to Buddy Ragnarok, there's definitely going to be a lot of searching. So this is going to be a pretty good sideboard card for a lot of decks if you want to try to turn off your opponent's deck from searching. So it's a really solid card to get. But this just leads me into the elephant of the room. So obviously, given the current situation, I don't necessarily think their timing is exactly a good idea. So I have Star Guardian Jackknife Freebuddy as a really good example of this, where this is the monthly shop tournament promo for the month of August. And oh hey look, we're in August, and oh hey look, not everyone is open up. So certain players, even if they wanted to participate in these events, they can't because their shop isn't opened up yet due to their local situation. If players want to try to play in a shop to get this promo, they actually can't because their shop might not be open. Certain shops in certain areas are open, I will admit that, but I'm pretty sure the vast majority of places are currently not open up yet or are choosing not to open up due to, uh, you know, their customer's own safety. So Bushy Road trying to tell us to go play at our local shops that aren't open yet seems like a very bad idea and is spelling a recipe for disaster because players want these promos and they can't get them because their shop's not open. So that also extends into the Bushy Shop Leagues. So even though that's starting out next month, what's to say the situation is going to change in a month? So, okay, let's say the situation magically changes in October. Now you have four weeks to participate 
which means certain players might not even be able to get the participation prize according to the rules that they have laid out. So again, this whole thing just feels very poorly timed and in very poor taste, even though the cards are very, very good. It's just nobody can really play in the shops to get them, or the shops are limiting the amount of people that could be played in. So let's say a shop has a large amount of audience that wants to have these events. Well, they have to reduce that audience so that way they could adhere to social distancing. So, like, it's just a ginormous no-win situation based on how poorly timed this is. And while I think that the Bushy Shop League is a really good idea, and I hope they implement it as a normal event next year, I think this year is just a really bad time to start rolling this out because not everything is going to change and not everyone is opened up, and that's only going to restrict the amount of players who could even get these promos. And... That's just a very unfortunate thing, and I don't necessarily think Bushy Road cares, but I have no idea if shops will be able to hold on to these promos for when they do open up and can run these events, or if they can even get the promos to even hold for later. Again, it just all feels very poorly timed, in spite of it being a really good idea. So... That's kind of all I have for this video. Feel free to tell me your thoughts down in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content, and I will see you in the next video.